turning down, but you'll see right there, let's see, let me go down, you zoom in a lot. Okay, so, you got 200, let's play it. And if I take it down, hear that, hear that crummy frequency, you're gonna take it way down. Pull it out. Let's pull it. I mean, honestly, Let's try looping. And if you want to set your looper, that was a way to set the looper, but I don't. You remember how to set a looper on here? Oh, perfect. Yeah, that. that's a yellow line. And yeah. you click on this little deal down here. That's going to make something loop over and over. It's going to start playing over and over. The little yellow line. And I'm just going to make it. There we go. I'm going to pull it out. So here it is. It's going to go all the way. It's going to. It's going to. It, it, uh, when it hits the end of this yellow line, it's going to turn back. It should turn back. And start playing over again. So now we can kind of we can kind of audit it and make sure and pull it back to the beginning. Kind of we, we just let it play. We can EQ this way. You know. Now, any sub frequency that sounds sub frequency sounds horrible. You know, something in there. This is high mid range. That's what I do a lot. Move it around. Look how clean that sounds right there. I just I just took the treble up. I turned boost up to 5k. It makes it more clear. We'll let it come around again. It's not coming around. It's just... Oh, there it goes. The point is, you get your effects. Try playing with it while it's playing. Come on now. Maybe it's, uh... Now it's doing something else. Well, I don't actually know how to select this uh, wave that I had before. So you're, you're choosing different little, uh... So if I take the treble up more, it's going to make it more clear, right? The problem is now, the more I do that, the more like, like hissy is going to be in there because way up here, 5K, around 4 or 5K is where like your vocals and your the clarity is going to come out, you know? Like where 200 is where your boom is. Uh, but also if you get it up in this, two, this, this 20, 20,000 hertz, it's going to make a lot more of that hissy sound. Uh, but there's nothing in there because we got a pretty clean input coming in here. So okay, we got a we got a decent sound of our acoustic track, right? We have a manual EQ. Uh, let's try let's try some vocals. And actually, you know what? Really, um, vocals are going to be difficult unless you have. I was going to show you guys this thing here. Let's see. We, we we may have Daniel take over. I'll take the camera. But uh, this thing, like my cousin has, this little. This blue microphone. This is what you want to do if you would do guitar vocal demo. This is this is great. I mean, it's a little con condenser mic for 65 bucks. You plug it in with USB to your computer. And it should plug right in and play. Um, with Mac, I don't even think you have to install any software. But uh, you do vocals and use it with that. So really, if you know how to use your compressors and your EQ, you can make something pretty dang professional for if you have a computer and you have 65 bucks, you know, to spend. Um, so it's, it's well, well worth it. Uh, I tell you what, Daniel, do you want to... Uh, Daniel's the master of uh, using the, the, the compute the input. You, you, you want to show us how to how we record a vocal track. How would you do it if we cut one? Let's see. Just, yeah, and you change. Voice. There you go. So you probably want to change the input, right? And so now we're, I guess we're going to have to hold the computer up to Mylon's face. Is that what we'll have to do? <laughs> well... <laughs> I, just, I would just sing this far away and pick up. It's a really good mic. I mean, mm -hmm. for a built-in microphone like uh -huh. that, it is really good. Yeah, that's true. But yeah. It does pick up all the background noise. So if you have, so it picks up the fan running. Let's, in your, yeah, turn let's do this. Let's pull cool, like headphones so, in there. With my line, we're gonna have to sing it far. Do you have a part you can sing my line? Uh, we like one line in there. Oh. Not much. Perfect. Sing, sing one line. I'll show you guys this. Uh, this is going to make a pop if I unplug, unplug, unplug these first because I'm going to the system. And so now we're just going to do, yeah, I'll go ahead and unplug that. So headphone out, right? That way all our sound is going only to the headphones. It's not going to bleed in to somebody else's stuff, to the, to the tracks that are playing. It's not going to bleed into this mic. Um, you'll probably get feedback if you're trying to do these speakers going to that mic. It's probably going to sound terrible. So always plug in headphones when you're recording. That's such a great you know, standby option. Uh, we're just going to have Mylon's singing to it, and everybody's going to be quiet. And I'll tell you what, we're going to go up to, uh, let's do the preferences again, right? Because we want to change the input we have. Go back to audio MIDI. I'll zoom in so you guys can see. 
put the audio input, it's gonna go back on built-in microphone because we want to record out of this now because we don't have anything else right now. Uh, next time we might show you all with this stuff. But I'm not borrow my cousin's uh, blue microphone. We can go through that, you know. But we're using built-in mic. So, okay, do you want to try? So let's all, and we're gonna click on voice. We're gonna arm that. See that right there? That's arm. You can see the channel. You can see it micing up and see how much we got. You can every time somebody you know trips or falls down or whatever, it's gonna pick it up. So okay, you wanna you wanna stand close to that there, Mylon, and uh, pretty loud over there. Let's do let's do a quiet click. Real hot over there. It probably is over there, right? Mm -hmm. Picking up everything. It's definitely on this yeah, side of the It is on the so, left side, though. So perfect, it's on the left side, okay. So, um, and we're gonna give him some time. It's gonna have a count in. See, it's good because he, on that metronome, let's see. Let's see, let's turn the metronome back on. Let's command U, but one, two. Oh, that's right, we have this thing. Let me pull this back. One, two, three, four. Those little clicks, I'll go back, y'all can hear it. The loud, the loud hit, that's one. Bop, bop, mm -hmm. bop, bop, that's one. One, two, three, four. So he waited a full measure to come in, which is really good. So, and I'll let you, is it the head, headphone jack there? Or yeah, it? Yeah, cool, okay. You hear it? Yeah. Okay, good. This, this headphone jack is kind of screwy in this computer. Has some trouble. So, okay, go ahead and sing into it, and we're just gonna hit record. It's my American life. My American life. That good? Perfect. Great. Good job. Let's plug it back in the system. So, of course, the same thing.